Hello, welcome to the Bindi Kitchen. Today we're going to be making a green smoothie. So it's a really easy way to get a whole lot of nutrients in to a smoothie. Um, you know that I love smoothies. I, I still really enjoy a whole foods diet, but smoothies are a great way to supplement that diet. So this is perfect for, um, you know, a Monday, you might have been out eating different foods on the weekend or training hard and having maybe a pretty high carbohydrate intake and maybe not if it's got as many vegetables and greens in. So this is a really great way to, to get your nutrient levels up for the day. So to start with, basically, we always start with a base of um, milk. You could do this with um, coconut water as well as another option if you didn't want to have any milk. I'm using almond milk, but you can choose any type of milk that you like. Like I said, um, coconut water or plain water with some ice is another thing that you can do. So um, I'm going to just put in some vanilla protein. So the idea with protein in this smoothie, it's not necessarily being used as a recovery um, smoothie, but the idea with the protein is it's going to keep you fuller for longer because if everything else that goes into it's just greens, then you're going to get pretty hungry pretty quickly. So vanilla is really versatile and great for that. Um, look, the star of the show today for um, the smoothie is the Super Greens powder. So this is really great. So um, two teaspoons a day is, is ideal. So the Super Greens, if you've not used them before, the idea with Super Greens is they've got um, high levels of antioxidants, lots of B12, lots of iron. So really helpful, especially for, for women that are racing and training and training hard. Um, but for all athletes, it's a really helpful supplement. So, oops, goes everywhere. Um, two teaspoons. Now, looks terrible, um, especially when you mix it up. It can look quite brown, but, um, and super greens have had a bit of a bad rap in the past for not tasting great. I can, um, be really happy to let you know this one tastes like cranberries. It's really yummy flavour. If you don't like it, you know, let me know. I'd love to hear from you because so far everybody just loves the flavour. So it's not your average super greens. Give it a go. Um, now, so basically a whole lot of spinach. It's not easy to get that in your smoothie jar, but just basically shove it all in there. Um, so really trying to get our dose of greens in for the day. So about a cup of spinach. Um, and then I've got some avocado here as well. So to get a bit of fat in there, again, you don't want to feel too, um, too hungry after having a green smoothie. So the avocado can really help with those healthy fats as well. Um, so some cucumber, nice to have um, a bit more liquid in there. And um, they really help to, to bulk it out a bit and get some more nutrients in there as well. So basically that's it, pop all your goodies in there and um, straight onto, onto your blitzer. <laughs> That's it. Um, again, like I said, it's not a, it's not the the best colour. <laughs> well, it's green, but um, the super greens powder can be quite dark. I'll show you the colour in here. You might be able to see it a bit better. But it's a beautiful creamy with the avocado, creamy, yummy smoothie. The cranberry flavour makes it taste great, and you just get a really good dose of your daily nutrients. So it's a really nice, easy way to um, to bump up your nutrients for the day. And again, you could use that instead of a meal. So if you have, um, you know, you might be on the road, traveling, busy, whatever, you could take that as a, as a lunch. Um, so you've got some proteins, you're not gonna be so hungry, bit of fat and loads of greens in there. So give the green smoothie a go. It, um, it can just change your life, really. I love it.